lots of reps today uh, as I did a um, new, I started a new uh, volume squatting cycle. So I went back down to 120 pounds. It's always fun to not even have a plate on the bar um, as, as you're doing your work set squatting. But um, I added a rep on to the last three sets of um, of this workout and I haven't actually really watched any of this footage so now I'm kind of considering what I did here. Um, so you know doing sets with 10 reps I don't even really care how much weight is on me I don't like it uh, <laughs> for squatting but guess what this is really teaching me how to more efficiently handle weight as I tire through a set. So as much as uh, frankly today it was just like awful. I mean, it's pathetic because there were four sets. I had four work sets and honestly, like after the second one, I was just like, God, I really want to get through this. Let's just, let's just go and get through this. But I, I did. Um, and I kind of auto-regulated it and, uh, you know, I knew I wanted to do, um, 11 reps for at least two of the sets. That was a little high because I do that with my first rep. Sometimes I don't know why it's stupid. Um, so, uh, you know, I I did um, 11 reps um, for all three of those uh, those later sets in the workout, and I'm happy about that. Um, and they went pretty well. Now I think maybe it was this set, man. As you get into the the end of the set, you can just really see that I just lose steam, uh, just in the way that my hips kind of uh, you know lock out. We're not, I'm not seeing it yet, but I, I really, I know that I just kind of like lost steam. It was kind of sad just at the top. It was, I mean, actually it didn't look too bad. Man, I was just like, I'm not popping through this. This isn't jumping off my back. Um, and by the way, over on the left there is the, the uh, faithful PVC pipe that I take to the gym every day. I swear people around here must see me walking to the gym with this thing be like, oh, there goes the girl carrying this random piece, plastic piece of pipe. But, you know, this thing is like, is, is awesome. It's like my best friend. Uh, it's, it's really, this is like the only thing I can feel when I go to roll out. I, the foam roller is like way too soft. So, um, I, I love it. And there it is. There's my homage to my, my little PC pipe. So, um, I think today overall, I, I did pretty well. I went beltless um, just because I have this kind of uh, arbitrary rule, I'll admit, that like if I don't have a plate on the bar, I really need to um, to not have my belt on. So um, I think the same maybe goes for when I deadlift. I have, I have rules for having a belt on deadlifting too. Um, really, really ridiculous rules. But um, so, yes, we're going to finally get to um, this last set here. I mean, it takes a while to get through these, and I did try to move the reps fast, which is why I may have cut some of them high. I admit it. I'm still having issues with that. I don't know if they were high. They're just, like, really borderline, which sucks. Um, some of them will sink deeper, but I, I, you know, I'm not super happy with my depth um, on some of these reps, I have to admit. Uh, you know, it's, it's just, it's kind of something once again that I'm playing with, but I really can't make excuses. I gotta, I, I really need to maybe try to dig a little deeper. I found on, you know, my heavier day recently, it was easier for me to dig deeper. Um, with this weight on my pack, I honestly kind of like, I don't know, it's a little different. So once again, really don't make excuses. And as I go through the set, I, I usually sink them a little deeper because I feel like I'm starting to suck. So I want to make sure at least I get the depth right. Um, yeah, so let's move on to the good mornings that I did, and I did this first set with, um, I did a warm-up little thing with the bar, but then I did this first set with 85, and I'm still, like, kind of figuring out what to do with these, uh, I admit it. I really haven't, um, I haven't want, done too much research on these any, any time recently, and I hope, you know, I hope the way that I'm performing these isn't completely ridiculous. I have a pretty wide stance, um... And I will tell you that, you know, as I do these, I never feel it in my back. I'm not, I really don't think I'm breaking at the back too, too badly here. Um, I, I definitely feel my hamstrings. So, you know, I'm going to take that as a sign that I'm probably not sucking at these too badly. Um, I definitely, I did three sets of this today. 
Um, and I, uh, you know, they, they feel, actually, I really have fun doing them. I don't know why. I just really, really enjoy doing them. It's weird. Um, so, uh, but I, I walked, I felt like, okay, walking away from these, but then, um, I went over to my backpack to put some stuff in there and, and I, I kind of leaned down just, you know, in a reasonably similar way to, um, performing this exercise and my hamstrings like shook and I was like, okay, well that must've actually done something then. That's, that's cool. But yeah, I need to probably still just do some research on these and make sure I'm, I'm really activating what I need to activate here. Um, but I'm trying to get my hips, uh, you know, to come back. I'm really, really sitting back into them, and I'm feeling a stretch in my hamstrings as I do this, and then kind of snapping up. Um, so, you know, 95 pounds, really maybe not like the heavy so I could be working with here. I'm kind of working into them slowly and just trying to do them for more reps and watching for form breakdown. Um, so I'm, I'm going to keep working up in weight, I think, uh, this cycle. And just kind of keep doing them, see if they help with anything. Uh, that will be an experiment. Um, yes, I look so happy coming off of that. Okay, so um, I guess update on the, um, the question of bulking. I... Um, I don't know. It's a very slow process, right? So how can I really give you an update? Like, I, shoot, this is going to take weeks and months to really have happen for me to turn to a fatty. So um, everything is basically kind of just progressing as I learn more about what to do for that and kind of just like weigh my options, no pun intended. Um, and so we'll see, uh, you know, how, how big I am by July and whether or not I compete in July which may or may not have some um, bearing on, or the weight may have some bearing on that, I kind of admit it. So, all right, we're almost done with this video, um, and I'm going to have a benching one tomorrow that I have to do um, just takeoffs by myself for this session, and it might be a little bit rough because I'm not good with that for uh, over maybe 80%. Anyway, so thanks for watching, and um, I will see you tomorrow.